we're adding some harmony. Again, not with the intention that if it's got more harmony in it, then it's automatically better. Not true, okay? But it does offer you options. And it's E7 flat 9, and I'm going to do this. And then we get to... Now again, if I'm playing solo guitar, I'm going to play that root on the bottom. In this style of playing, a little can go a very long way in terms of giving the ear the harmonic picture. There's the G6. There's the E7 flat 9, which again is a diminished chord substitute. Bar 21 is a B minor 7 flat 5, and we've seen this voicing before with the root. Now if I needed to and I'm playing solo, I can play... It's not easy, but I can... <laughs> And then I get the free open E if I'm playing solo guitar. In some cases, if I can't get everything I want happening exactly simultaneously, I'll sort of parse it out. So I'll give it to you in, in pieces. So I'll play. So I gave you, at the last minute, the root, the bass note. Each one of the pickup notes has been harmonized. Now again, it's not better than the other versions. It's just more harmonically busy, more active. And then we go to there. So that's a lot of activity. I'm interpolating the E flat 9, which basically is a, um, a tritone substitute. So, and then I got, it's nice to have options so that you don't have to play exactly the same thing every time. 